Hey guys, what's up? My name's Goldbird, and today I'm going to be telling you about a really cool program I um I found on the internet. So, um, are you have you ever went to a hotel and they're like, oh, you can only have one device um connected to our Wi-Fi? Well, um, I went to a hotel um just this last week, and they said that um we can only have I think it was two devices connected to the Wi-Fi. Um, like, period, you couldn't, like, switch one off, you have to have one device, and only one device. So pretty much, I found something to, um, I found a loophole to that. So pretty much, you download this on your computer, um, you can also download this on your phone, I'm not sure if it's on Android, but I know it's on iOS, you have to pay for the iOS version, but for the Windows version, it is completely free. So anyways, um, this program, um, pretty much takes the Wi-Fi that you are current, your computer is currently working on, and it makes a new Wi-Fi from that. So it uses the same signal, it uses all the um, stuff, but it just um, makes it so you can use multiple accounts off of that one. So pretty much, um, go into Google and just look up Connectify. So there we go. So it's the um, PC Wi-Fi hotspot. Do um, click download. Um, I will have the um, link in the description. So this is just an ad saying, um, oh, you can get the Max version for 75% off. Get it to get today. So the Max version has a few other things, but I'm just going to get the free version because it works perfectly fine. So thank you for downloading Connectify, and it should start downloading in a few seconds. There we go. It's right there. So. Um, click that and start getting it installed. I already um, have it installed on my computer at the moment. So I have an icon right here, but I um, like going down here. So right here it's a little um, logo. It, it has um, it's a Wi-Fi logo with a gray um, gray circle around it. So <clears throat> right now this is this is my um, my hotspot settings. So this should be set to no internet, I th I'm pretty sure. That should just, this should be a random number. Connectify slash random, it should be like a number, you can delete the number. You can't delete the Connectify because unless you um, pay. And then you can set a password. So, right now I just changed the Wi-Fi name to Wi-Fi name. Or the hotspot name to um, Wi-Fi name. And then the password to password. Just because I'm not really doing this for real, I'm just, you know. so. Choose the um, the hotel's Wi-Fi or the Wi-Fi that you will be sharing. Right now, I'm using my um, my Wi-Fi that I have at my house. So right here, um, the, once you have all this set up, um, quick start. So while this is starting, you will need to um, you will need to restart your computer after the installation just to make sure everything works. So <clears throat> so as you can see, um, this right here. So it, sh it shows you um, how many are connected to your hotspot. Yeah. How many are connected to your hotspot at the one moment. Um, how many people that are connected who have Connectify. And how many um, have previously been on your hotspot. That's just an ad that pops up. <clears throat> so um, pretty much I'm just going to full screen this real quick. There we go. So anyways. Um, it shows you that the Wi-Fi is on by the little, so anyways, it shows you that the Wi-Fi is on by the little check and it says sharing Wi-Fi up at the top. It says your password and you can hide the password or you can show the password either or and it says your name up top and it says zero clients. That means, um, that there, it, how many clients is how many people are connected. So anyways, I'm, I can connect my phone, um, right now, but I'm not going to just because... I'll do that a little bit later. So right now, I'm just going to open the previously connected tab for a, few, um, for a second and show you something. So I'm just going to go into the iPad right here. And as you can see, it shows you the um, the usage, how many um, how, how much it, the iPad has downloaded, um, and how much it has been upload how much it uploaded. So anyways, um, if you if you're um, 
Wi-Fi that you're using can only use a certain amount of like data or megabytes or gigabytes, then you can see who's using the most. And if you need to, you can kick them off by like just stopping it and changing the password or, you know, I'm not 100% sure how to um, kick them off, but yeah. And um, if this will have problems sometimes, so sometimes you have to go back to the settings over here and you have to, um, <clears throat> you have to stop it and then restart it. These um, two right here are paid programs that you cannot use, but that, um, so, yep. Right, really quick, I'm going to connect my phone and I will be right back. So as you can see, my phone has connected um, to the Wi-Fi. It tells you, um, okay, so as you can see, it's been, my phone has connected. So it says, um, it shows you my download, it shows you how much I use, the speed, um, that uh, it's downloading, the upload, the, um, how much it's used, speed of the upload. And this is a little line graph that shows you how much they're using. So it will go up and spike and everything. But right now, um, yep. So anyways, that just shows you what that is. And, um, you can, um, I'm not sure what the, the drag files to fling is. I've never tried it. Um, but I'm pretty sure you can, like, send files, like, photos and stuff to that, um, person's phone using this app. Or using this, um, program. If you hover over it, it shows you the IP, so I'm not going to do that. And then you can restart it right here. Um, rescan. But anyways, so yep, I'm going to disconnect from the Wi-Fi, so it should switch from connected to disconnected in a few seconds. But yeah, that's um, the thing I use. It's a very, very um, amazing program. I like it just because it's so easy to use, and it's just an it's just so easy to use, and I love it. I use it, um, I've used it a few times already, so it's disconnected. But yeah, I'm just gonna, um, just gonna go into settings and turn it off. If you like this video, like, comment, and if you're new to the channel and you haven't subscribed already, you should subscribe. And, uh, yeah, thanks you for watching, and, uh, have a good day.